That's at bbc.co.uk forward slash inside out. The Hollywood actor Harrison Ford has been injured after a small plane he was piloting crash-landed on a golf course in Los Angeles. The 72-year-old star of the Indiana Jones and Star Wars films is said to have suffered a cut to his forehead, but is in a stable condition in hospital. Our Los Angeles correspondent Alistair Leithhead reports. At first, it looked bad. Harrison Ford being helped by paramedics after being lifted out of the small vintage plane. But it had been the perfect emergency landing, clipping a few treetops before coming to a standstill on the eighth hole. The patient was in moderate condition, alert, and conscious, and breathing, and was transported to a local hospital. Air accident investigators have already arrived on the scene and will be trying to establish what went wrong. He'd just taken off from the nearby Santa Monica airport when he started to have trouble with the 80-year-old plane's single engine. Witnesses said he'd circled and was trying to land when he was forced to come down. 53178, engine failure, immediate return. Ryan 178, runway 21, clear to land. 3. Ryan 178, runway 3, clear to land. Some guys put him, uh, the, the, the person inside the plane, and then I, I saw that they put him on the ground. So when I see they start moving, it's so all good. He's alive. <laughs> His son, Ben Ford, tweeted an update. At the hospital, he said, Dad is okay, battered, but okay. He is every bit the man you would think he is. He is an incredibly strong man. Harrison Ford has been flying for years and has already had a few scrapes along the way. Well, what a dramatic landing, just metres away from houses and from trees. Han Solo and Indiana Jones would be proud of a landing like this, and we can say that now that we know that Harrison Ford is OK. The question is, at 72, is he now doing his own stunts? And how is he going to top this in the new Star Wars film? Alice Luther, BBC News, in Santa Monica.